morning everyone. How are you feeling Sam? How are you feeling? <laughs> Sam can't speak at the moment. Oh, <laughs> He's Fresh knackered. As a Fresh as a daisy. Look at him, look. He reckons he was fit as a fiddle. Look at him. <laughs> Blowing out of his ringer. <laughs> and me oh. being the athlete I am. Sorry. Right, so guys, today's another video. We're obviously at the beautiful Brighton Marina on the east wall. Um, I love this place. I've got here and the weather is the, the water's glassy. Today's a sip down. I'm a bit gutted, but I haven't fished the East Wall for a long time because it's been closed because of COVID and travelling and all that old crap. Um, so, yeah, today the weather was amazing. I was meant to be coming yesterday with Westy, but the weather was a bit crap. Westy couldn't make it today, which is a bit gutting. Um, um, so, but anyway, Sam was coming either day, so Sam's here. Um, my mate Steve will be here in a little while. I've got a feeling the Ginger Ninja Kira might be down, but I don't know. I haven't actually spoke to him this morning. Um, so, yeah, obviously we're fishing for place. We've got fresh blacks. Um, we are through the gate for the first time in about a year. We're a bit further around. Yesterday there was squid caught off the pier. There was place. There's, um, yeah, look at that water. Look, all the boats are out today. If you own a boat in Bright Marina and you're not out and it's a day, then you need your head looking at. Honestly, you really do. Um, so, yeah, that's the that's quick intro. I want to get some gear set up. I want to get fishing. Um, <clears throat> I will bring you back, show you the rigs and, and tactics and tic tacs and all that old malarkey in a bit. When Sam's finished dying, oh, um, no, I'm, sure, I'm sure he'll say hello. <laughs> yeah, you look it, son. <laughs> He was, he was walking around going, oh, we're there yet. Oh, I need to stop. I'm dying. <laughs> I couldn't, honestly, honestly, honestly. And I mean, obviously, I'm, I'm, I'm not the slimmest of people, but I could, I, I could quite, yeah, look, not, not a dribble. And I've got two jumpers on. Not a dribble. And I mean, the thing is, I, I could quite easily stick all my gear back on my back and go again. Honestly, I could, honestly, go on, you feel the weight of my box. Oh. Let's, let's have a little... Everybody remembers my box. I mean, look at the state of it. Look, there's still bluey on it, blood from last time. But... Bam, bam, bam. Oh, my God. I cleaned it out. Are you feeling all right? Four reels. Bag of rigs. A couple of knives. My false scanners. Yeah, it is. Hold on, hold on. That is not all. Oh, my even, God. Even in there's been sorted out. I mean, I don't get me wrong. I've had to put it... Look, it's all clean. It's all sorted out. It's all... Oh, you're going to annoy some people. Do you know right? what? I'm like a new man. Well, apparently oh, so. It, it, it's, it, it's, it, it, oh, it's a new me. It's an absolute... Yeah. 31 next week. It's a new me. What a load of bollocks. In a bit. Right. There's already one rod out, guys. Uh, on the zippy. And this is the other rod about to go out. So this is my go-to rig. You've all seen it a million times. It's the Tuat Loop rig. Um, obviously with the sea glow beads on it because you don't go place fishing without green and black beads from sea glow um, four ounce of lead because the tide is still ebbing for about another hour and a half um, we got here early to get a spot and it's already it's already pretty busy there's a few lads there there's a couple of bays there's one either side of us at least so steve <laughs> my mate steve bless him he rung me 10 minutes ago where are you then i said well, i'm on the end of the pier there's only like another 10 or 15 bays up there and uh, he went, well, I'm on the end of the pier, and I didn't see you, and I thought, oh, dear. See, because down in Brighton, you've got the east pier. If you've got an east pier, that means you've probably got a west pier, which is over there. And funnily enough, Steve was on that pier waving at me. So he's got to the wall now, walk all the way back along the west, all the way back across the marina, and then all the way around the east. Um, yeah. Not a great day for poor old Steve. So, yes. Right, well, that's the bait, that's the rig. That is how I'm fishing all day. Um, bring on the place. Sam's got one. First chuck. Homemade rig. Made by Emma, though, Sam. No, no. What do you mean, no? Oh, no, it is homemade rig, yeah, sorry. Yeah, it is a homemade rig. It's not one of mine. Sorry, guys, just wipe the camera. Wicked. First one for Sam. Literally, that was 20 yards off the wall. Not that I can't cast any. No, it's like. just that he's using a new multiplier today. It's his first time with multiplier. The level wind is on. It's wound up as tight as you can. Literally, you ain't even got to stop it with your finger. First chuck. Oh, Sam, how long is it? Stick it on your box. I reckon 26. No, it's longer than that, look. Oh. 32, I was miles away. Right, get it on up then and get it back out. Let's get some more. Steve's finally here after going for a walk around the whole pier, all the way round. Well, that'd be bloody exercise. <laughs> <laughs> um, he even wore his flotation suit all the way round as well, the nutter. Right. Sam, yeah, I could see you. I'll see you waving, yeah. 
Well, I'm going to help Sam unlock this fish because he looks like he's struggling. It's deep in converse conversation. That's not the word I was looking for. Deep. Is it? We'll get it out. Yeah. Right, in a bit. Sam's had two today. Sam is cooking with gas. He's, um, to be fair, well, let me zoom out. Oh, that was very, very jank. Um, very small one. It's very, very, do you know what? It's hard. It is packed along here. Absolutely packed. Either way. Um, and there's just nothing. We are two and a half, two hours before our water. Well, I think I, the last bit of record I've done was like four and a half hours ago. It's dead. And because it's so packed, there's tired run and no one's got a clue what they're doing. If, if everyone's going over everyone, it's an absolute nightmare. Absolute nightmare. Um, as you can see, the wind's picked up a bit. Here, the wind's picked up a bit. Um, I'm still blanking, which I've never ever blanked on this pier. Never blanked on this pier. I'm not gonna, I will get a fish, watch. Next, the next bit of this video will be bringing it back to me with a place, guarantee it, in a bit. Right, so, so, so obviously me and Sam come today, Sam's Mrs. Emma's come down to see him, <laughs> bought his son Jack and bought his daughter Eva, Ava, Eva, Eva. and uh, Eva. so yeah, Emma's decided to have a little chuck and, and she's actually hooked it decently as well. And she's unhooked it herself, unlike her old man can't. Uh, she cast it herself, unlike Sam can't. So I saw what you got him. Tiny little place. A tiny little place, it's but bigger than my last one though. She's got one. Unbelievable. The last one was even smaller than that. Unbelievable. Anyway, that that's enough of that. <laughs> In other words, Reese can't cope that he's being beaten by other people. Yeah. I, I, I can cope with being beat by a woman, but being beaten by Sam. Well, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, that's it. I'm going. In a bit. Finally, finally, finally. It was very, very lightly hooked. Look at that, look. Literally in its lip. Look, it was finally, look. Absolute little beauty. Let's tuck it back in. Chuck it on, Steve's. Oh, yeah, I'll stick it over that side so you can see it's on the way over there. Hello, mate. Thank you very much. Gone. Well, so, I need to get that one. Sam, have you got to I've had two. Well, I need two more. Cool. A bit of live footage from Sam, bit of live. He's just had a lovely bite. Um yeah, I, I really hope he's got I really hope he's got a fish, but then I really hope he don't because then he's beating me 3-1. I oh, hold up, I'm getting a bite unless Sam's over my line. Yeah, no, I've definitely just had a bite on that rod and the line's gone slack. So Sam, could you please, please hurry up? Hold on, no, hold on, hold on, let's see. No, oh dear, look, there it is. Sam's reeling me in. Emma, could you? What? Do the honours and record? Because yeah, Sam reckons he's got a fish. Hold up. No, Sam hasn't got a fish. He's got the fish hunter. Get over here, you bellend. There's always one, isn't there? He had a really good bite and all, and he missed it. Go on, reeling. Silly Sam. There's no fish there, is there? No. It was a bloody good bite and all it was. Bloody good bite. All right. In a bit. Right. Number two, literally, I'm just that was my second one to reel in to pack up and go home. Today has been an hard work day. It, the pier was ramo. Hang on, Jack, give us two sticks. The pier was absolutely ramo, and uh, we just didn't, yeah, it, it didn't happen. It didn't happen for me. Uh, one subscriber, though, Gus, will pass and said hello. And uh, Sam, do us a favour, mate. Could you quickly unlock that for us? Um, yeah, Gus walked past. He was fishing right up peg 60, right up the end. I thought I was near the end, but it turns out I'm only like 35. Um, he had 13, and so did there another fella up there had, up the other end had a, had a, had a few more. Um, but Gus actually managed my target, which was a 50 centimetre place. He actually had one at 51 centimetres. Um, so massive, massive well done to Gus. Let's get this little fish back. Um, another subscriber i didn't get your name hopefully you watched the video thank you very much for the tote rig gave me a lovely tote rig so uh hopefully the tote we'll get this year we'll dedicate to him um if we get one but yeah that is that is pretty much it when we got here this morning it was nice and glassy now it's quite it's pretty rough really the wind has swung around a little bit more but yeah it's not that bad um as you can see the pier's properly emptied out now compared to what it was earlier um a couple of fellas down that way did have a few plates and we was we couldn't for the life of us think why one they were casting very short they were casting very short and uh 
getting them and I think maybe maybe we was overcasting I've never used that word in my life but because I don't normally overcast but yeah they was getting them really close in and they had ragworm and we only had black so maybe ragworm was the one who knows um, either way probably a pretty short video to be fair um, we will see you on the next one and the next video is going to be me and Sam are going out, out at the weekend next week sorry out. out out we are going out on the boat we're taking the boat we're going to have a road trip to Paul maybe the Bristol Channel maybe Cornwall who knows maybe even Wales just to wind them up a little bit more <laughs> um, apparently we're not allowed to go to Wales Sam have you got fish on there? No? Um, yeah, apparently we're not allowed to go to Wales, so we probably won't go to Wales. But listen, any of you guys that know anywhere that's catching fish, we are after Blom Rays, we're after Place, my main target's a turbot. Anyone knows where we can go, we're taking the sib, we're taking the beach gear, we're going to do the day night and see where it takes us. Um, as long as there's a chip shop nearby, I can get a batter sausage and chips and a can of Diet Coke, that's all I'm really worried about. But no, so Blom Rays, turbot, cod, we want one of them. Sam would be happy with dogfish, but don't listen to Sam. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.